Oh. Good day, YouTube, and welcome to another episode of the Albino Rhino Beer Review. Today you have the Rhino, and we're going to look at this beer right here. Alicia's back there. She's going to try it with us. Um, yeah, today we have from North Winds Brewing, which is right across the street from where we are currently. This is a mild ale. It's Yacht Club. It's 3.9% alcohol by volume. Uh, I don't know if I'm allowed to make this video, you know, I kind of look happy in it. Not allowed to look happy ever in my life. Nope. No, not allowed to look happy. Get in trouble when you look happy, apparently. Yeah. Um, because, you know, never in, with mental illness has somebody ever looked happy and not really been happy. Not that that's what I'm saying is going on right now, but I mean, not that ever been a time in, in you know, say, Chester Beddington or Robin... Mm -hmm. Robin Williams or a uh, plethora of other people uh, that people look at. You know, it's never happened. There we go. So 3.9% alcohol. Nice color. Look at that. That's a beautiful, like, ruby color. Almost. No, it's more like a mahogany brown, isn't it? Let's get it back here. It is. Yeah, more like a mahogany. More like kind of like the desk this camera's on right now. Dang. Different light, you know, I don't have any lights on. I could turn this on. Could you? Possibly, Put if I figure in. it out. There you go. Ooh, yeah, there we go. A little bit of light. A little bit of light. Ah, oh, let's give it a sniff. What is this one? Yacht Club? This is a Yacht Club Mild. So it's 3.9% alcohol, so a low ABV beer. I like milds normally. Mm. Kind of smells slightly roasty. Roasty, little bit of chocolate, little bit of caramel, little bit of coffee. <laughs> normally I give her the first sip, but not today. Yeah, yeah. <sighs> uh, you married me, don't feel nice to me anymore. Very light, very refreshing. Lots of black coffee flavors, lots of like almost charred wood, a um, little bready biscuitiness. And probably a perfect mild. I mean, that's most that's that's great for a mild. I mean, you don't see this style very often because you can't hide any imperfections. If you screw something up, it it shows. It's three point eight percent alcohol. It's like lightly flavored. Um, it shows that you have your bready biscuitiness, you have your black coffee, you have a little charred wood, you have a tiniest touch of chocolate. All in all, I think it's great. What about you? There's like a bitterness there that I didn't really I like. I think that's, it wasn't the, that's the charred wood. but it wasn't... That's like the charred like, wood on yeah. the back end, the burnt. The rest of it was fine. It was just that little hit of that bitterness that kind of made me go through. I'm sorry. You were being hidden by the uh, can. Okay. Do you have anything else to say about it? No. No? Back pretty, to playing your games? I think it's a pretty standard beer. Mm, yeah, it's a pretty standard English English ale. Um, nice, beautiful, mild. I kind of wish I had bought more, but at the same time, it, three cans over there was what, like 15 bucks? Yep. Yeah, it was, uh, it was the, one of the more pricier breweries. Too, yeah, it was the more pricey brewery. But it was because also like one running a full kitchen. and. That doesn't matter. The, the bottle shop should be a normal bottle shop type mm -hmm. of thing. I mean, like, we have what? We had 14 beers here, and one brewery we bought... One brewery was close to the same price, and we bought eight beers from. So, I mean, that's that's the type of... But didn't you say they sometimes, like, have trouble keeping up with supply and demand? Yeah. So maybe that's why they're a little higher. Out of 10 from yourself, fun? Yeah, I'd give it a 1. Like I said, I wouldn't ever really go and get it. That bitterness kind of threw me off. See, you rate so harshly. I'm not... It's not that... Okay, I think... It's out of 10, that's the thing, okay, right? So when you, you say a 1... Maybe you should say, I'm out of 5. Because really, okay. I'm never going to buy... I'm not going to buy beer. I'm not going to be a beer lover, ever. You really need to stop, like, asking my professional opinion and asking me to rate beers. Because really, I'm just offending people left, right, and center. <laughs> not my intention. Most of the people so, I've met in so this industry me, are very lovely people. 
from me, I think Yacht Club is worth a 9 out of 10. That is a amazing mild. I would drink that all day. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching. Rhino, Alicia, Yacht Club from North Winds. Uh, I don't think there's anything else to talk about, so bye bye